got married when I was 20. I had my first little girl when I was 21. We called her Karen Charmaine Maria. My brother-in-law gave her a nickname, Lally, because she used to make a noise, la, la, when she cried. Anyway, everything went all right and she was a few months old and I realised she wasn't doing things that me, like my sister-in-law's or my sister's children were doing. So I took her up to a um, health clinic. They confirmed that she was had severe brain damage, cerebral palsy. We lived in a caravan and they said that eventually she'd be put away in home like because being a traveller they couldn't cope with her. I was determined not to have her put away because it's not my nature. She was mine and I loved her. I looked after her. Then I went on to have my second child, Tracy. She was born perfect. And then I had my third daughter, Vicky, and she was all right. And then my other son, Rudy, was born. He was born exactly the same as Lally, with terrible palsy. So then I had two to cope with. But with the help of me husband and me two daughters, I did look after them well. They had schooling and that what they needed. And that's how I come to settle down, really. We're such a close community on here that there was always somebody here to help if you wanted them. You only had to ask. Or if not, they'd come and ask you. And, like, we appreciated one another. Lost the boy first. He was 16. Then six years on, I lost my daughter. She was 32 when she died. And she had a lovely, beautiful funeral as well. Travellers come from hundreds of miles for them and just had a lovely send off and the flowers. People come from miles just to pay their respects to Lally. Being how she was, you wouldn't think that people would be so kind. At the end of the day, that's how the travellers are. They got respect for one another, no matter who they are and who they're not.